Hi, in this video, we are going to see about a Python project which is entitled as Dog Breed Classification Using Inception ResNet V2, which is an IEEE 2023 conference paper. So, before seeing the execution of the project, let me brief about this project. So, we all know that dogs as various breeds or classification. So, even all the human beings cannot identify what is the exact breed of the dog name only few can able to do it who is already expertise in it so we need a uh, scientific approach so that the artificial intelligence system can able to identify the exact version of the dog breed so what is the need for identifying this dog breed is like uh, for animal welfare like uh, giving some uh, treatment to the dogs who identifying what kind of uh, breed it is one giving some uh, treatment so veterinary care kinds of thing and also for the uh, human animal interaction kinds of things so there are various applications on that so in this base paper the authors have developed the dog breed classification uh, using the inception risk net v2 so this is the model they have used and they have classified based on the 120 breeds and uh, they have achieved the training accuracy of 95 percentage and the test accuracy of 88.92 percentage so we are not going to develop the same as mentioned in the base paper so now let, us, now let us see what is the proposed model so in our proposed implementation model we have developed using inception architecture so the dog breed classification using the inception architecture and the training accuracy that we have achieved is 91.34 percentage and the test accuracy that we have achieved is 89.45 percentage so we have improved the model using exception architecture we have improved the test accuracy and another thing the base paper they have used only 120 dog breeds but we are going to increase the dog breeds to 133 class classification so now let us see the data set part so in the source code model folder we have the data set test train and valid validation so in the training part you can find all the 133 classif the, the dog breed uh, classifications so here you can see the first one is a fun pincer so which contains around the 64 image data sets so other one is a fan hound so these are the images of the second breed third one is a radial terrain so this is about the third one third breed so in this way you can see that 133 so last one is yorkshire terrain so i cannot show you all the things it takes more time so now let me go on to the execution part so before execution make sure that you fulfill the requirement that is mentioned in the requirements file so before that let me show you the abstract document so here you can see the IEEE base paper title dog breed classification using inception resnet v2 but our proposed title is dog breed classification using deep learning or deep dog go accurate dog breed classification using exception architecture whichever you wanted you can choose it and this is the abstract that is mentioned in the base paper and this is our proposed abstract which contains about the details of the project that we are going to do it which contains the exception architecture and as i mentioned the tenure accuracy and the validation accuracy and here you can see the total images of all the 133 classification is 7550 dog images so total data set part uh, is 7550 images and here you can see the existing system which uses the inception resnet v2 and what is the disadvantage of the existing system and here the proposed system about our proposed model using exception architecture and here are the advantages of the proposed model and the system architecture which contains 133 dog breed image data set and we apply the inception architecture and here we predict the name of the dog breed and here we have the final performance analysis and graph so this project is developed using python version 3.10.9 so now in the requirements file you can 
find the exact version of the python and the library is required make sure that you have fulfilled the requirement that is mentioned in the requirement file now let us see the execution of the project so first go into the copy the source code location now go to the command prompt now first go to the drive location where you have pasted the code in my case i have pasted in f drive so first i'll go to the f drive now type cd space and paste the location that we have copied so now we are into the source code location now type python app.py and click enter and kindly wait for few minutes so now you can see the url just copy this url go to any of your browser i'm going to firefox now and just paste the url that we have copied and now you can see the home screen a welcome screen of the project with the project title dog breed classification using deep learning just click this login menu it will be navigated to the login page kindly note that this is a static login page because we have not used any database in the project so just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and then click the login button so now the login is success and click ok so now it will be navigated to the preview part where you need to select the image that you wanted to predict the case so first let me click this browse button now go into the source code location where you can see the test folder so in the source code folder you can see the test folder where you can see all the 133 dog breeds classification so i'll show you few cases now let me go to the first case affan pincer and let me select an uh, random image and click submit and now you can see the image that we have selected and the prediction result is a fun pin sir so now let me go to the preview menu again so if you wanted to check with other case click the preview menu so not will maybe get to the preview part again select the browse button and go to any of the brow any of the classification so now let me go to this bagel and now let me select an image and then click submit so now you can see the image that i have selected and the predicted result is beagle and now let me click the preview menu again to check for the other classification so now let me go to this part boxer and now let me select an image and then click submit and now you can see the predicted classification the predicted dog breed is boxer so this time i'll click the preview menu and this time i'll go to the uh, train folder so I'll go into the source code folder model where you will be having the train test and validation so let me go to the train folder and now let me select this Chinese crested so let me select this and then click submit and now you can see the predicted result is Chinese crested so in this way you can check with both the test case or the train case that we have trained up with so here you have a question many people will be asking me that what happens if you are giving some other animal image for elephant or a tiger kind of thing so it shows some random result only because we are we cannot able to train up all the images that is available in all over the world the model uh, becomes very big and training times take more time so we are just trained up the model only with the images that we have shown you so you can give the input image only with those images that we have trained up in case if you are giving some other images it gives only the random result only so now i'll finally i'll show you the last case yorkshire terrain and click submit and now you can see the better result is yorkshire terrain so in this way you can check with the other cases i cannot show you for all the 133 it takes more time so now let me move to the final part that is chart part so once if you click the chart part it will be navigated to the chart part where you have two charts that is model loss graph and model accuracy graph so kindly note that this is a static chart only so this is not a dynamic chart because we are not using any database and also it does not varies according to the input that we are going to give so this plot has been predicted depicted from the model code that we have developed in the back end part so 
it does not varies according to the input whatever you are testing with so this is a static chart so this chart contains model loss graph which has the loss and epochs that we have trained up with and the second chart contains the model accuracy which has the accuracy and the epochs that we have trained up with and now let me log out and this is all about the project dog breed classification using deep learning or dog breed classification using inception resnet v2 and thank you for watching